What's up everyone and welcome to another Guild War and today we've got Pinnacles and let's start with uh, let's start with this one alright so I think first team is quite simple we'll just do Bulldozer Copper alright we're gonna take out the Chow uh, with Copper and then uh, the Monkey King should be fine to be dealt with with Bulldozer Hopefully he's not too tanky. That would be awkward if he if he survives. But I think we'll be have a, we have a decent decent chance even if he survives. So let's go with that. And this second team, uh, let's see. All right, how about we'll just do the old-fashioned way of Holy Trinity, right? Because uh, uh, the, the Chloe's gonna buff, and uh, whether she buffs. Before or after fuel mods, I'm not sure. Um, like I think these days, like well, generally speaking, a lot of Chloe's will be faster than fuel mods. But like you know, for me personally, I try, I delib deliberately make my my Chloe slower than my fuel mods to protect him right after he moves. But I don't know if every, I don't I'm not really sure if everyone does that. So let's just do yeah something like this to be fairly safe. All right. Um, Yep, let's go with that. Okay, buff up and take out Chow. Because <clears throat> he's like the main threat, right? He, he's going to threaten Bulldozer. And he does a lot of damage. Um, and tends to violent proc a lot too. So I want to get rid of him first. And we'll take out the Monkey King so that there's no more threat. Ooh, but... Okay, that, that's, that's a bit awkward. Now I have to basically just crowd control and, right, and try to kill him through the chest soon heals, which is not gonna be not gonna be easy. I gotta I need to hope that my Buddha stuns here. I was kinda afraid of this, but you know with MSC's uh, attack bar reduction, like I should be able to control how much he moves and then eventually Copa can you know kill him again. Right, with, thunder, with, with the thunder strike, or maybe uh, bulldozer can um, can kill him uh, with with his uh, first skill, or even his second skill, oh, the third skill. Sorry, eventually once it refreshes. But seems like we managed to I managed to control the fight long enough that you know, Chasun doesn't go crazy with healing the monkey key up, king up, and you know I can do enough damage between two DPS to take him out. So now uh, I think I think I missed the missed the uh, marching shout but it's okay. And we just take out just soon now. Wow the Chloe is slower than my Praha that's a bit awkward. Alright so I'm gonna have to try to stun her. Nope. Oh that's not good. Alright, so I have to basically, even the Orion's a lot slower too, so I have to wear this out. Oh man, Praha got stunned too, so she couldn't even remove the will rune, obviously the, uh, the, the immunity buff. I, I need, I need, uh, Field Master Violent Proc here and take out the Endure, but he did not. Uh, I can't even heal because of the heal block. So let's try to. We we'll just try to stun him. No, it didn't work. Oh god. Well, I can. I can. Uh, Oblivion. Okay. Now I need to hope that. Oh, even if feel my Svan procs. Wait. Okay. Uh, I think I've lost feel Mars. Because I can't. I can't. Uh, Heal him up. Let me think. If I can get enough attack bar and stun the Orion, I might have a chance. Nope. I mean, I, I want to just win and like, I lost Phil Mars, that's unfortunate, but we should, we'll, we'll win anyway, so I'd rather take the win than stay Phil Mars here. Well, that's fine. We could try like some different comps. I don't know. It's gonna be a bit more awkward because you know, Phil Mars is one of my main offenses. But 
We'll see how we go. Oh my god, look at that. It's so annoying, <laughs> the violent procs, but he will die eventually. So I'm gonna just auto from here. Oh, so now I get the despair stuns though. Okay. Let's move on. Uh, let's have a look. Okay, we can try here. Alright, so this one... Yeah, we'll just borders are the first one. Right? I have to... Cause like, it's like my main way of dealing with Phil Mars teams. So, let's do that. And this second team... Let's try... To wombo him, right? With slow will shield. Except I'll take out Emir because of the Hua and I'll put in a. I'll let, uh, we'll use Alicia as the other, other Nuka. Okay. Uh, that way I have. You know, everyone will have elemental advantage against that, that team, right? As long as one Nuka survives, uh, one Nuka survives, um, the other one should be able to take them out, right? Because they're all very. Low HP units. Okay. Take out that one and Veramos. I mean, I don't see you guys seen this lot uh, many many times, but you know, if it ain't broke, don't don't fix it. Okay, I need to get a stun. Nope. Man, that's, he's like countering every every hit. No stun, but hopefully he doesn't violent proc and kill anything. Alright, good. Alright, he got, he got rid of the shield, which is a bit annoying. Oh, okay, that's fine. The double hit. Really saved her there. Uh, actually, I could just storm midnight because I think well, storm midnight does more damage, especially because all of these units are fast. So this should one shot everyone. Yeah, that's safer than doing the, the third skill for anyone that uses Alicia. The third skill, like, it's good for finishing stuff off and then getting the extra turn. But if you rely on it, trying to one shot everything, it's quite unlikely, even even on like those really squishy units. So the second skill will, will generally do a lot more damage in, in that sort of situation. Well, actually in most situations, will, it will be better. Let's have a look. Okay, we can do this one, I think. Uh, uh, this, is a, this is new. Lexi. Decreased damage. Ooh, okay. That's a pretty good combination with Chasun, because uh, <clears throat> like this one, it, it, it Lowers HP recovery on heals, right? But because Foreign Blossom is not consi considered a heal, it's rebalancing. Um, it, it has, it doesn't like this passive doesn't affect it. So it's a, it's a good combination, or interesting combination. We can we can do this one. Uh, in actual fact, I probably have to, I have probably have to just bulldoze at this one again. Uh, she so she's got branding and defense break. Alright, so yeah, she'll probably defense break like something and Filmas might kill it, but I think we should be out last. Like, Bulldozer will take out the Lexi turn 2. Alright, and I think like Coppa shouldn't have any trouble killing Chasun, even with the damage reduction. So I think that we're fine there. And then the second team. Uh, so when there's Orion, usually I'll just outspeed with Bernard. Alright, that's like. Very easy way to counter, especially if they only have one major threat. In this case, it'll, the main threat to me is the Veramos. Like there is the Monkey King, which might kill Bernard, but I'm, I'm happy to sacrifice Bernard, you know, to tank uh, Monkey King if if necessary. But I think I mean, this is the last sword anyway. I can sacrifice him; doesn't matter. Okay. 
So we take out Chasun. 42. Well, that was that was cutting it close, I think. Because you know, some Chasun, like pretty high level ones, will be like 38k HP or so. So um I was pretty fortunate. I mean that damage reduction was surprisingly a lot more than I thought it would be. Okay, well copper pretty much dead, but we should be able to pull through. Uh, body press to do that. Oh, got copper dead. All right, so the pop the endure. Yeah, okay, there we go. And hopefully stun him before he moves. Mm, okay, he didn't violent proc, so that's right. Because I. You know, as you may have seen in the previous videos, uh, there is a chance that he can go crazy and kill both those units. Alright, so let, let's take out the Veramos. Alright, Monkey King will still go for the Bernard. Alright, uh, even though that the Galen's defense broken. Or well, he should, at least. Alright, so we'll just try to take out the Ryan mm, pretty close. I can't actually stun the monkey, but like the Orion's pretty much dead anyway. So I'll just do the crush on Monkey King to get as much damage, you know, as I can in, and that's pretty much it. Okay, we've got plenty of time still, so let's just do a, uh, a random. RTA, alright. And we can uh, you just fill in some time with that. Alright, first pick. Uh, let's just go safe. Uh, we'll go with. Um, or oh, semi safe. Let's just go with Orion, turn one. Like, pick one. Okay, he's gonna go for a wombo, which I'm not sure whether it's really that great, personally. Uh, so that's like, I think, I think um, it's like the wombo, right? I can just ban one key unit. And it's very hard to draft a, a wombo team, in my opinion. So I'll just bring like very tanky units for, for the time being, and we'll see what he what else he picks. Okay, so he's got he's got one damage dealer at the moment. Alright, so I'm gonna bring Praha and I wanna bring another tanky unit uh, if possible. Okay, we'll bring Chroma, she's sort of pretty tanky. Alright, I'm here. Okay, so now what if I just ban the Galleon? Right, that he's got no attack buff. No defense break, right? Uh, only defense break is the Bernard, really. So I'll just do that, and I'll make a Chroma my leader for even more tankiness. Alright, he's getting first turn. That's fine. If you can remove wall runes. That's fine. Reset. But he's not gonna, I don't think he'll be able to do enough damage to kill anything, right? Okay, wait for the stun. That's fine. Uh, so we just work on the Zyros now. Actually, do I even care about Zyros? I think the only thing I really care about is Amir. Because Amir's got the... Uh, he's still got the third skill up, so let's silence him. Okay, he might kill Praha. Oh, well, very close. <clears throat> oh, I think... He could have killed Praha, I think. Oh, wow, he, his Mami cut in. That's a shame. 
Let's just do this. Almost everything will die now. Let's just take out uh, Amir because he's gonna threaten my my uh, Varad. Right, so now he's got no more damage dealer. There we go. So yeah, if, if you're gonna build a one book team, just gotta think very carefully. If Galen's your only defense breaker and attack buff, then he's very like a very easy thing to ban. And if you don't have any other uh, unit, units that provide that sort of thing, then you know the opponent can just go for a very tanky deep, like you know, tanky team, and just outlast your two damage dealers. Like the Zyros was a good pick still because it still resets even the water units. Um, but as you can see, I can still just tank through it with everything else, right? It was very unlucky for me that my Kuma, my Kuma's actually decent speed, but he didn't cut in to heal up my Praha, which could have punished him. Because he could have just done uh, the second skill on Chiwu, and that, because it's crushing hit, right? He probably could have killed my Praha, or like just straight out with him. And yeah, so. This is, that's pretty much it for me today, so thanks again for watching. Um, if you if you like RTA, or if you don't like RTA, let me know, because like, I, I won't show it if people don't like it. But if you like it, then I'll continue doing it while it's still available. Because um, I don't personally like doing RTA that much, uh, but I'll do it, I'll do like a, a little bit, you know, if people would like to watch it. Alright, so I'll see you guys in the next video, and have a good one. Enjoy your rune removal. Bye-bye.